from the Ford Sports Desk, KOMU 8 Sports. Welcome back, everyone. Two schools said goodbye to the Big 12 Conference last year. This year, the rumors of Texas A&M heading to the SEC shows that yet another university might look to jump ship. The New York Times reported on Monday the president of Texas A&M sent a letter to the Big 12 Board of Director Chairman indicating the Aggies' withdrawal from the league. The Big 12 chair is Missouri Chancellor Brady Deaton. This morning, Deaton talked to Columbia radio station KFRU, where he disputed receiving a letter from Texas A&M. It's been eight months since fans got to watch Mizzou football in action. Mizzou's game against Miami of Ohio this Saturday puts an end to that wait. This year will be head coach Gary Pinkle's 11th season. Missouri returns 17 starters from last season. Some of those starters will have to start the season on the sidelines due to some injuries. Wide receiver Jarrell Jackson and defensive, end, defensive back Kip Edwards are both listed as doubtful for Saturday's game. Plenty of Tigers will step on the game field for the first time in their careers. Mizzou's Molly Kreklow is the Big 12 Player of the Week, but the awards don't stop there. The Volleyball Coaches Association named the Tiger sophomore its National Player of the Week. Kreklow won the Tiger Invitational MVP award after her team picked up four wins to start the season. Kreklow averaged more than 37 assists per match and picked up 42 against Idaho State. She also had 13 kills and 16 digs. And while most fans make their way to the football field to watch the Fayette Falcons take on their opponents, one fan can enjoy the game from the comfort of his own home. Don Seiford lives in this house just right up the street from the high school. From his porch, he can see every tackle and touchdown. But when trees and brush get in the way, Seiford makes the five-minute walk down the field, a walk he has frequently made when his son played football at the school. Seiford says he has the best seat in town. That's it for sports. More news after this.